Hey guys, what's going on? This video tutorial. I'm going to teach you guys how to get rid of the Windows 10 notification that keeps popping up when you decided not to upgrade to Windows 10. I have Windows 7 currently, and the reason why I'm not actually upgrading is because I can't use certain programs in Windows 10 that I can in 7 right now. But I'll teach you guys how to remove it and have that notification stop bothering you guys. So, the very first thing you're going to do is go to the search. On Windows 8, it's going to be on the side, and you'll see a little magnifying glass up here. But on Windows 10 or Windows 7, you're going to type in Windows Update and just click the very first one that is from the control panel. On Windows 8, you want to be careful because there's two options for Windows updates, so just make sure it's the one from the control panel. But what you're going to do here is you're going to go to installed updates at the bottom left and you're gonna go ahead and type in this update which is also in the description of this video so go ahead and paste that in there and you will see this update from Microsoft Windows so you can go ahead and uninstall that would you like to uninstall this update yes and just wait a few minutes So now what you're going to do is click restart now. After you've restarted your computer, now you want to go to the search and again go ahead and type in Windows Update and open it up. What you want to do here is check for updates. So go ahead and click that. So after you have checked for updates, you're going to go here to where it says show all available updates. You're going to right click on the update we just uninstalled and click hide update. Then you're going to go here to where it says optional. You're going to go to where it says upgrade to Windows 10 home and you're also going to hide that update. If you want to restore those updates we just hid, what you're going to have to do is go back to Windows update and go to restore hidden updates check both of them and restore if you restore them then you are obviously going to want to upgrade to Windows 10 otherwise there really is no reason to restore them so that's it guys I hope I helped thank you guys please like subscribe comment peace out